Hi everyone, my name is Steph, this is Kid Lit Joy, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to review Dinosaur in My Pocket by Ashley Barton. This is illustrated by Blythe Fielden, and it is a gorgeous little narrative picture book. This was sent to me by Hachette for review, so thank you very much to them. This is about James, and James is a little boy who loves two things. He loves dinosaurs and he loves miniatures. In his bedroom he has an entire shelf that is just full of miniatures that are his prized possessions. One day James goes to the museum on a school excursion and he sees the most perfect little triceratops sitting on the shelf. It's a little miniature and he really really wants it but he just doesn't have any money for it and so when there is a bit of a distraction he slips it into his pocket and he takes it home. As he is getting closer and closer to home the triceratops begins to get bigger and heavier and take up more space until eventually his parents come into his room to find a huge triceratops in the middle of the room and they finally ask him what is going on and so the story about how he is stolen the dinosaur comes out and so they have to fix it so the dinosaur gets returned and James has a discussion with his parents around how he could possibly earn the dinosaur and what follows is him learning that he can do jobs around the house he can earn pocket money he can do things the right way so it's a really gorgeous story about one why stealing things is bad but also about honesty and working with your family to earn things that you'd like. It would be a great story to read with kids when they are just starting to do jobs around the house and earning pocket money and to think about how they can save up for something that they really really want. It's beautifully illustrated. Like just look at the dinosaur. I love a triceratops. They're my favorite dinosaur of all time. I just thought it was a really gentle way to talk about why taking things that don't belong to you is bad but also there are other ways that you can go about those sorts of things and about having open and honest communication with your family or your parents or your caregivers. So it was really beautiful in that way. Ashley Barton's writing is wonderful. As I said, the illustration's gorgeous and I love the color palette of the story. So thank you again to Hachette for sending this to me. I will leave links to where you can find out more information about the book below. If you've read this story or you know similar stories, feel free to chat to me about them down below. Otherwise, feel free to leave a dinosaur emoji to let me know that you're here. I hope that wherever you are in the world, you're staying safe and healthy and I will see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye everyone.